Hello Scorpio, it's my lady from My Lady's Way Tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly reading for the week of July 23rd through the 31st, 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish and I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. Um, I want to thank everybody for like, share, and subscribing and setting up personal readings. And if you want a personal reading, just check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Um, I don't know if I said this, but make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs if this doesn't resonate. And let's see what this says. So, somebody is offering presents and not giving it to them. And somebody is, uh, somebody is, is offering sex. So, I feel, feel like somebody is getting, uh, presents. For sex, like somebody like, oh, I'm going to sleep with you. Okay, I'm going to sleep with you and I'm going to give you $1,000, but they ain't give them $1,000 or something like that. But it's secrets going on about this because they work together. Oh, geez. And I feel like you told somebody at your job and they telling everybody now. All right. Sleeping with your boss for money. That's what that was. All right. So going on for the, the Scorpio Scorpio what's going on for Scorpio for the week of July 24th through the 31st 2017 Scorpio 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 well that was a crazy start okay some of you have been wanting to start a new relationship or getting pregnant for a long time I, that's just what came out there and say anything about it. So, got some sacrifices going on here, Scorpio. Okay, so, ooh, so this um, this could either be somebody is a trip. This being sacrificed, like no, you can't go on this, or somebody is sacrificing living at home. Like I feel like somebody is trying to move somewhere else, but it's not happening. Okay, Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. All right, so. Yeah, somebody is coming out of a place where they was having nightmares about this situation. Yeah, I feel like all this might be getting ready to be over for some reason. Let's see. Okay, so some of you are fertile. Okay, that's just what this means. But I feel like somebody is letting go of their self. Somebody is, some of you are moving in with somebody else. Some of you are moving in with somebody else and y'all ready to start a new beautiful thing. But y'all was going through a period where yeah, it was freaking y'all out. You know, for some of you, you never moved in with anybody before. Some of you, I feel like you moved in, you moving in with somebody like quick that you really didn't know. And I feel like some of you are moving like way far to be with somebody else. Like you're leaving your family and friends. And that's why this was like freaking you out. But I feel like now that you're here or once you get there, you're going to love it. But Ah, yeah, be careful because some of you might have moved in with this person because you're pregnant or you got them pregnant or you're very fertile right now. So just like be careful. I mean, in some of you cases, I feel like you might be pregnant by somebody who always had already have a baby or you guys may have lost a baby together or something like that. Yeah. All right. Um. This feel like you work with them. Okay, this could be either you work with them or you got, uh, y'all having like some kind of power struggle. You feel like that you're going to lose your power by being here, moving in with that person. You don't have your independence anymore. That's what I'm feeling like here. Okay, all right, so we got some secrets going on here. All right, what are these secrets for the Scorpio? Scorpio, Scorpio. What are these secrets for the Scorpio? 7, 24 through the 31st, 2017. Mm. Okay, so the secret is about whoever's been going back and forth to visit their person. 
So I don't know which one of you have been doing that, but what is the secret? What is this secret? What is it? Oh, somebody been dealing with their ex. So yeah, I feel like the secret has been dealing with their ex, but you know, I feel like you're getting over it. The, where I got the X from is I looked up and I seen this like something is hitting when I see this skull right here that to me looks like you know the X you know somebody that is no not nobody to you anymore but it's you stepping over it you know you're stepping over it meaning that you in that bad territory again you know so I feel like for some of you you're actually still visiting your exes after this after this move and then this is the way you're trying to empower yourself but just be 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 prepared to get caught because cheaters never win all right so yeah get rid of that baggage or you're gonna get caught all right so cleo cards read these straight out the book make sure you get your full message all right what's going on for scorpio 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 what's going on for scorpio for July 24th through 31st, 2017. Scorpio. Scorpio, Scorpio. Mm-mm-mm. General reading. So, this could also be happening to you. Okay. Yeah, I feel like some of you lost a baby. Yeah, so this could be somebody was pregnant and they lost a baby. And then maybe that's why they feel like they lost the power. Because when I see the Empress card, I think of the baby in the reverse. I think of like either lost it or somebody postponed it or somebody asked for a baby. And the other party said, no, I don't want that. I'm not ready for that. Got a lot of sores up here with this. All right. So what's at the bottom of the deck? Give and take. All right. So let's read these straight from the book. First, we have the four swords. Four, 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 four. All right, so the fourth source says, can indicate lack of sleep, can show a need for some time away from negative situations, possible illness. I feel like in this case, the negative situation is you not completely letting go of your ex. So let that go and just live, because it seems like in this new future, it could be something good, but you won't let it because you keep got your hand in that rotten old cookie jar. All right, so now we got the ace of swords. Ace, 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 ace. Do, 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 do. All right, the Ace of Swords says, you're able to move in many situations with great power. Trust your own abilities. It is time to win. So basically, I feel like no matter, I don't know, I think as long as you let go of your ex, you will be fine because it's not just the ex that's messing you up. You got that mental state of power with you moving in with your new partner or with somebody, it could be a, a just a regular person. But I really feel like it's a a partner, you know. But it's like you're gonna be good as long as you let go of your ex. But like, just relax about the move. That's what I'm feeling. All right. So you got the Empress, and she says honesty and full disclosure. So I feel like something is going to come out about, about this ex. And if you be honest, I think it'll be it'll push you toward a good time and 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 trust, you know? It it'll, it'll start building some trust between you and the new person. But as long as you trying to hide that, it's going to crumble everything. It's going to ruin everything. Just like it did when y'all was together cuz if y'all was still together, y'all probably left because of lies don't go back to them lies and start bringing them to the new relationship is it really worth it is what i'm trying to say like without all the talking i love to do all right so we got the two of swords upright a choice between two things may occur look for people who offer friendship and mutual respect and guidance so this is basically like you came to a crossroad before about am i gonna move there or here now you come into a crossroad where should i let go of my ex well you already moved in with this new person so this ex you need to deal with that all right so we got the six of coins it says you may receive unexpected money a time of economic gang approaches you uh if your hands are out to give it will be out to receive this is basically i feel like you can do this with your current person. Don't go back to that ex for nothing because it's only no good connected to it. 
Other than that, that's all I got. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs if you want a personal reading. Description box below. Other than that, you guys have a wonderful week.